into the dome keeper again while we talk about charity truth or dares and burgle bananas all right a1 has gifted two subs to emma and Seferin. what am i doing a1 truth or dare hey we're close to a hype train sleepy kevin let's see what these are you do not want dare because the dare is tell a dad joke i shit you not the dare is to tell a dad joke oh it's not gonna focus the truth is what's the craziest thing you've gotten away with truth is what's the craziest thing you've gotten away with dares tell a dad joke craziest thing i've gotten away with sleepy yuck Uh, do both. Well, deep of the fortune bits. Hype train. We need three people to do a hype train, sadly, and you are the first person. But if someone else does something, it's a hype train. Thank you, Lodiva, for the 400 bits. The craziest thing I've gotten away with, dude. It's probably the craziest thing. Well, let me start a game of Dome Keeper, then I'll tell you the craziest thing. I'm gonna try Repellent with Sword Dome Classic. The craziest thing I've gotten away with is taking a shit so bad in my work's toilet and my boss had to like take the toilet out and take the poop out of the pipe because it was so disgustingly large and he never knew it was me. That's probably the best thing I've gotten away with. He never learned it was me. He, he, he was telling the story. He's like, dude, some customer took a giant dump in the toilet and he was like, it was so gross. I was like, dude, that sounds horrible. He was like, yeah, it was like, before you guys left, did nobody check the toilet if it was clogged? I was like, ah, I guess not. Nobody used the washroom. And in my head, I was like, I used the washroom right before I left last night. What did I eat? Chicken. And he was like, dude, it was the, he was like, I had to put a glove on and everything. I'm like, ah, oh, dude, that's nasty. That's the best thing I've ever gotten away with. And for a dad joke... You better not sneeze in front of me, because the only things I'd bless are the rains down in Africa. <laughs> That's such a stupid one, but I love it. Lodima, thank you for the 400 bits. Do you want a truth or dare card, Lodima, since you gave me money? I only got so many of these, but... I would like a hype train as well, Sleepy Kevin. You want another one? Ooh... Shark, thanks for the 200 bits. You want truth or dare? We need another bad joke. Hype train started. Shark says dare. The dare is eat a lemon with a straight face. I don't have a lemon, but I have lemon juice. The truth is, share the biggest prank you've ever pulled. I've never done any pranks. I don't have a lemon, but I have lemon juice if that counts. A spoonful of lemon juice? Beans only happen every $25 for the National Breast Cancer Foundation. Cat, do you want to give me a spoonful of lemon juice? Dude, I literally just brushed my teeth. You're telling me to eat Stormy? That's not gonna happen. Dude, oh my god, Stormy has been such an asshole since Nami got back. Because Nami smells like the vet. So she's she's not used to that scent that smell. So she's just hissing constantly at her. And we don't got vanilla extract before you recommend that. Also, throw to the world. Good morning. Beans, those were the days. I have beans. Every $25 to NBCF is a bean. Money to me is a truth or dare because that's easy. Vanilla extract is a thing. Apparently, you put vanilla, vanilla extract like... Like, on their cheeks and, like, on their nose, and apparently it does something. I'm not 100% positive on what it actually achieves. 
but maybe it like resets their senses or they just like smell exactly the same so they're fine with each other or something not 100 percent sure but apparently that's a thing but last night i decided me and cat were like all right so since these cats are being assholes and they're big fucking babies one of us needs to sleep on this air mattress that has a bunch of holes in it that we're both gonna sleep on next week because your family's gonna be here one of us has to sleep on this fucking thing with Stormy in the room, and Kat was like, I'll do it. And I'm like, oh my god, my hero, I can get a good night's sleep on my nice cozy bed because I'm so exhausted. And Nami's like, oh no, I'm gonna scratch at everything. I'm gonna play with the food. I'm gonna throw litter everywhere. I'm gonna make all the noise in the world. And I'm just like, oh, you devious little bitch. So I, once again, have not gotten an adequate amount of sleep. You use vanilla extract when bacon? There's more uses to vanilla extract than just bacon. Just like there's more uses to bacon soda than just bacon. Bacon soda is very good with cleaning stuff as well. And just having it in your fridge to make your fridge smell better. But yeah, so I... Did not... Get... A lot... Of sleep. But it is very good in bacon as well. When I was a kid, my favorite smell in the world was vanilla extract. Oh, love the smell of vanilla extract. Because it smells like fucking vanilla. Vanilla smells great. You kidding me? So because of that, I have not gotten a lot of sleep. But we are going to continue Dong and Rampa tonight. So for people that are fans of the Dong and Rampa, um, tonight at 7 p.m. we'll be starting the investigation for the second trial. Also, after Domekeeper, I'm gonna be doing demos with the Steam Next Game Fest. So, for people that care about game demos, we're gonna be playing a lot of demos in the morning. Also, Big Danny, if you're in here, I saw your Overrider was on the front of, like, Steam and everything. How did the Overrider stream go on, for Steam Next Fest? Did I download Robocop? I forgot to. But I have like six days, so I'll download it. Uh, maybe I'll download it when I'm playing another demo. Because I have the space for it. I forgot to. Listen, yesterday after the stream, I just went to go lay down because I was so tired. I just went to lay down after yesterday's stream. I was so fucking tired. Not amazing, but good. Well, good is still good. Thanks for the hype train as well. And remember, every $25 to NBCF, I get to eat the most disgusting thing in the world. Bean Boozle. Ugh. Ugh. I was thinking of doing $50, but I thought that was too much. So I was like, I'll do $25. I was like, I'll do $25. I can handle that, right, Dylan? You can handle a little bit of that. Good morning, Paul. How are you doing? We got about 1,000 wish lists, which isn't a lot, but oh well. I mean, that's not bad. 1,000 people are wish list in the game? I'm one of them. I'm 0.1%. I'm a statistic. Pretty good today, buddy. How am I? I am pretty tired. I did not get a lot of sleep. I wonder how much sleep I got, according to my phone. I still don't have my lemon. I guess I can get the lemon after this. But I got a nice little care package from NBCF that has some truth or dare cards. And it also had Bean Boozle, which, ugh, not a fan of that. But I will oblige and play Bean Boozle. I'll, all right, I'll play along, I say. I'll play along. Oh, I need to get the mister in the battle. That's what's really good. Where's the pink hair? They actually, uh, they did send something to, uh, dye your hair pink. But, I felt a little offended because... I don't think it's gonna do much for me. What's up, Carly? Good morning. How was my evening? 
Kat and I ordered from a pizza place. I got a very good uh, pizza. Kat got some chicken. I got my jalapeno fucking poppers. Delicious. And we watched Bullet Train. And I really liked Bullet Train. I thought Bullet Train was really funny. <laughs> such, such a silly movie. I, I didn't know what to expect. I was like, all right, let's see what this movie's about. And uh, after it was done, I was like, you know, that was a good movie. Arlen, thank you for the hundred bits. Big bear. Nice anniversary night in. Yep, while cats were yelling at each other and being cats, uh, we were just watching a movie. I was so tired, like 20 minutes into the movie, I was like, oh my God, I'm so fucking tired. And she's like, we can just go to bed. I'm like, no, no, we're going to watch this damn movie. And it was a very good movie. What movie? Bullet Train, Brad Pitt. And then was and then was a little man, but overall I liked it. I liked it. I liked it. It was a little long, but you know, for the concept, I was like, okay. That two of your celebrity crushes in it. My god, the first truth of Dare card I did ask me my celebrity crush was. You all learned it was Pedro Pascal. Have I seen Bottoms? I have not. Is Nami doing okay? Yes, but am I doing okay? Zulu Charlie! Want to contribute, but I'm making a point to avoid being boozled. Those things are an absolute stain on society. Thank you for the $24.99 to NBCF. We are one cent away from Bean Boozle. And for people that are wondering why I'm doing Bean Boozle, the National Breast Cancer Foundation sent me a care package. If you don't follow me on Twitter or don't use Twitter, um, they sent me a little care package and uh, it had Bean Boozle in it. So I said every $25 donate, every $25 raise is a Bean Boozle. But we are now one cent away from a Bean Boozle. But I agree, they are a stain on society. I hate them. But I was like, you know, if I could just eat a few fucking jelly beans, more money goes to Breast Cancer Foundation. And if you want, I can read you what your donation actually does. Your donations do a lot more than you think. I actually can't read you it because I left the goddamn pamphlet on the goddamn... I left the pamphlet on the goddamn table. I gave you all the statistics for what your donation actually does. The first third, it's super bad. The next third, it's Fight Club. And then the final act, it turns into something absolutely fucking bananas. It's in a wonderful kind of bananas. It has Marshawn Lynch. Why is Marshawn Lynch in it? I can get it when I get my lemon juice. Yeah, I owe Shark some lemon juice. In lemon juice. I owe Shark a spoonful of lemon juice because truth or dare. Oh wait, Arlen, you cheered a hundred bits. Do you want a truth or dare question? AKA for me, I do the truth or dare and you just get to laugh at my pain and suffering. Maybe I should make it cheaper, maybe make it more expensive than a hundred bits, but I'll do a dare for you. Dare, okay. Who's your celebrity crush, Carly? Arlen says dare. The truth was, who's the last person you creeped on social media? The dare is pick a viewer to write your next tweet and send it. Oh, I don't like that dare. Pick a viewer to send my next tweet? Oh, that sounds horrible. I should do Big Danny because then he just advertised Overrider. That wouldn't be too weird. Pick me. Streamer, streamer, me, 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 me. Streamer! I want to write your tweet. Come on, streamer. Pick me. I'll be nice. Write something homophobic and pick me. I'd prefer if, uh... It was TOS. 
technically Twitter doesn't exist. Shark donated $25 and one cent. Eat the beans, bozo. Eat the beans, bozo. Well, the good thing is I could have some lemon juice after these beans to wash it down. All right. Let's YouTube Let's Play. This is charity. Pete Davidson? He's a weirdo, but... All right, so we got two beans, thanks to Shark. I'll just pick two random ones. I'm not looking. I'm not looking. We got... Up a bean fell out. A this is a liver and onions or a cappuccino bean. Oh, dude, that's a lose lose situation right there. That's a lose lose. I think I like the liver and onions more than the cappuccino. I don't like cappuccinos. I'm pretty sure I like liver and onions more. Yeah, that's liver and onions. That's not too bad. Oh, I know. That's cappuccino. That's horrible. Oh, God. I'd rather have liver and onions. That shit's gross. How the fuck do people, people drink that every day? Then they die. Uh, maybe I'll just get a blue one. Yeah. Ugh. It's a stinky sock or it's tutti fruity. Oh, that's... It's a stinky soccer. It's Twitch chat. Tootie and Fruity. I didn't cheat. If I cheated, it would be a blue one. Because blue is toothpaste or berry bite. That's incredible. One of your celebrity crushes is Leonardo DiCaprio. Well, the good news is if you're 25 years old or younger, he might date you. God, let me go get this stupid lemon juice. Okay. Okay, I got a spoon and I got a lemon. He's a hottie. Me? Thank you. Why he dates such young women? Probably because he's Leonardo DiCaprio and he's so famous he can do anything he wants. It's one of those people probably. When you're when you're rich and famous for 30 years and get anything anytime anywhere you go, anything you want anytime, you probably become a little messed up in the head, and it's like, oh, I can do anything. All right, I owe you guys a thing of lemon juice. I don't have a lemon, but I do have lemon juice. Oh my god. That's a lot of lemon. Oh yeah, I can't make a face. I have to just... I have to just act a natural. Straight face. Straight guy making a straight face? Easiest thing in the world. Who's tweeting? Should I open up a Nightbot giveaway for who's tweeting? All right, let me open up a Nightbot giveaway to see who... YouTube Let's Play. This is the shenanigans that you miss when you don't watch the stream live. This is all going on YouTube. Marbles race? Nah, too much for a marbles race right now. Keyword. Tweet. Anyone can enter. All you have to do is type tweet. And while you type tweet, let me tell you what your donation does to the National Breast Cancer Foundation. They gave me a nice little pan flip to read because I wouldn't memorize this. Okay. 
Here's how your donation to the National Breast Cancer Foundation helps. <clears throat> Every game pick donation makes a difference. $3 can provide one woman with a breast health kit filled with both inspirational and educational items. $9 can provide one woman with breast health education and self-exam training at an outreach event. $17 can provide an essential navigation service for a woman in need. $30 can provide one woman with the life-saving help of a patient navigator. $50 can provide one woman with a hope kit filled with comfort and items to be used during treatment. $150 can provide one woman with a free mammogram. $1,000 can provide the opportunity for a patient to attend a one-year breast cancer support group. And that's just a little bit of what your donation for the National Breast Cancer Foundation does. And here's some other things you should know. Breast cancer can impact the important women in your lives. Mothers, grandmothers, wives, girlfriends, aunts, sisters, cousins, and friends. If you don't have any friends, congrats. You got family to worry about. One in eight women will be diagnosed with breast cancer in her lifetime. There are 3.8 million breast cancer survivors in the United States. NBCF provides help and hope to those affected by breast cancer, and the NBCF programs focus on early detection, education, and support, ensuring no one faces breast cancer alone. Due to COVID, NCI estimates that we will lose up to 10,000 people from the breast and colon cancers as a result of decreased screenings. So get your boobas checked, ladies. And thank you guys for donating some of your money to the National Breast Cancer Foundation. Every $25 raised starting today will be a bean boozle eaten thanks to charity giving me, uh, the charity giving me some. And if you give me money, I'll do a truth or dare if you want to give me money for some reason. I can't integrate both of them, but... Let's see who gets to write a tweet for me. Hey, Pete. Hey, Aries. God, please let it be Nyx. Please let it be Nyx. Oh, no. 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 What's the tweet, Arlen? Arlen said, I'm going to make you write homophobic shit on the timeline. <laughs> All right, Arlen, what are we tweeting? Well, it was nice knowing you guys. Please, let's let it be a normal tweet. Fucking 100 bits turn into that there. Your grandma's a survivor. She got both her boobs removed. Let's go. Give me one second to think of something creative. Uh, I'm going to lose my life. Uh, my life is over. Yes, that's one less channel I'm going to have to mod. Dare. Carly, thanks for the 100 bits with the dare. All right. What the fuck is that? The truth was, what, ha what have you purchased that's been the biggest waste of money? The dare is dance with no music for one minute. God. God. If people give me money, I do truth or dares because Game Pink sent me something abstract and every $25 raised for charity is a bean boozle. What's up, Cuff? <laughs> oh, thank you for doing a time warp. That makes it a lot easier to dance for a minute and then you guys get to not see my dancing for eight seconds. Oh. God. Fuck you.
That's been a minute, right? Well, at least we got that horrible one out of the way. Well, that's unfortunate. That was not unfortunate. All right, so for people wondering what the fuck is happening, if you give me money, that was literally three seconds. That was not three seconds. You're making me throw my dome keeper run. For people that give me money, I'll do a truth or dare. You can just ask which one you want. And for people that give the National Breast Cancer Foundation every $25 raise, we'll do a bean. I might yield more of the profits, it seems, so I might have to switch it up, but we'll see. It was not five seconds. That felt like a minute. It only felt like five seconds because people were doing time warp filters, and every time warp filter, you lost eight seconds. It's not my fault people were doing time warps. Oh, wait. It is because I made it. <laughs> any Yeah, any donation can be a truth or dare. That's true. Any donation can be a truth or dare. So if you even just donate to National Breast Cancer, if you donate a dollar to the National Breast Cancer Foundation, you can do a truth or dare. I'll run out of truth or dares pretty fast, I feel, but that's fine. I guess that's why they call it the blues. Hey, Maniac has redeemed VIP for a little bit. Joy. They literally just donate a dollar to NBC if I'll do a truth or dare. I don't even want to know what Arlen is cooking. It's... It has to be somewhat not anything crazy, you know? Like, you can't make me say, like, I love sucking cock on a Tuesday night. Oh my god, I love men and their big hairy butts. You can't say something like that. That would not be... I am posting a pick in Discord. Tweet. I found a pick and it made me think of Arlen XP. <laughs> Fucking fine. Fine. I'll do that. Let me. S <laughs> I just copy the image. Can I say I found this picture and it made me think of my viewer, Arlen XP? I found a... What the fuck is this? I found a pic and it made me think of Arlen XP. There you go. That dare's done. That dare's done. What bird does on a Tuesday night? Yo, don't be talking about my hairy butts. I like big butts. And I cannot lie. You other brothers can't deny that when a girl walks in with an itty bitty waist, you round it in her face, you get strong. So if any of you want to do a truth or dare, you can for one singular dollar, which seems like a very good spend, very good way to spend your money. Luckily, the tweet one will not come back. Thank God. What a great morning. The people that are on my Twitter will be like, what the fuck is this tweet? Dude, Enter the Gungeon just tweeted at me yesterday, and what if they're stalking my Twitter again? And then they see that. You saw that? Wasn't that weird? Like, it was awesome, but like... That was crazy, because Enter the Gungeon's one of my favorite games of all time. Dodge roll just unfollow? Joke's on you, they didn't even follow. Yeah, 
they know me they know i exist they didn't comment about the game where i was gassing up gungeon for 15 minutes or the video i was gassing up gungeon for 15 minutes they commented on my tier list saying good job put it in an s tier my streamer is famous yeah 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 Yeah, that's one of the career highlights right there. Enter the gungeon. Dude, let me tell you. I was just... Carly with the dollar to charity. Thanks, Carly. Dare. Dare. Good morning, Avatar. The truth is, what's your biggest regret? The dare is crack an egg on your head. No way. I wouldn't lie to you. Give me a minute. What a waste of an egg. I can do the truth if you want. I can tell you my biggest regret. It'll be about time you guys learn about the summer of 2013 with Jolene. The about time. It's up to game nerd. Fucking up to game nerd? What? This month. Maybe game nerd will be nice. Maybe game nerd will be nice. Game nerd, what would you rather have? Dude, that's not fair. I buy fucking Alberta extra large eggs. Those things are fucking huge. And I'm wearing my nice shirt. A1 doing $50. That's two beans. Two of your finest beans, please. Sleepy higher. What about a truth or dare? You get one of those too. You get one of those too, along with two beans. Do both. Truth and dare? How bad could it be? I don't this one's not possible because I don't have a jalapeno pepper. It says eat a jalapeno pepper as a dare. I don't got one of those. Never got a truth or dare. Well, that sucks. <laughs> you want one? I should have saved the popper. Got anything spicy? No, not really. The truth is, name five things you would bring to a deserted island. Uh, five things I would bring to a deserted island. Um... Lube. <laughs> I don't fucking know. Five things I'd bring to a deserted island. A machete. That's for one. Um, a book that teaches me how to survive on a deserted island. Survive on a deserted island for dummies. Volume three. Um, obviously, you can't just say like a lifetime of food, man. You don't, you don't need a, you can't say, oh, we bring a lifetime of food to a deserted line. It's like, no, that's not how this works at all. But, uh, so I think a machete's a good pick.
Kat, do we have anything spicy here? I don't think Kat's even listening to this stream. Aren't you, aren't you playing with Kevin tonight? That's Saturday night. Saturday night we're playing with Kevin. Saturday night we're playing Rocket League with Matthew and the president and COO of NBCF, Kevin. Also, hello, Brendan. How are you doing? And it's not Kevin James. But Kevin will carry us. Smartphone with satellite connectivity. Yeah, it's that simple. Machete, sleeping bag. Uh, one of those things that allows you to filter salt water easily. One of those would be good. Uh, some hair clippers, of course. From I, you know, I grow my luscious long hair. I don't want, I don't want it to be too long. Egg. Can we crack an egg on the head at the end of the stream so I can shower after? Anyone donate certain Rocket League Kevin has to do one? I might run out by them, but I could I could freaking take one and say, hey yo, Kevin, your turn. Hey yo, Kevin, your turn. No, less than three. Oh, thanks. But that wouldn't be fun. Dude, I put on my nice shirt today. Only if A1 says it's okay. God damn. Oh, I better, I better go get a fucking egg. Oh. It's okay. Did you not read my loopholes earlier? I don't have a plastic egg. It's for the greater good. Wait, I still need to eat two beans for A1. Let's get this over with. This is the buttered popcorn or rotten egg. Uh, these both suck, but I don't think this one's egg bad. I think this is just popcorn bad. Greatest regret in my life. Let me think about it. As I pick up a bean. Booger or juicy pear? Oh, that's nothing. I ate boogers when I was in second grade. I can eat a booger now. Sure, it's been like 20 years, but sure, they taste the, they, sure, they taste the same. Oh, they definitely do not taste the same. Or just still do. When you got nowhere to put it, you put it in your mouth. That's what I say about life. <sighs> After this dome keeper run, we'll do the egg. How's that sound? I don't want to... I don't need to make this dome keeper run longer than it needs to be. It's already been extended quite a bit. Ugh, so if you're wondering how can I do that, donate $25 and I'll eat an egg on your behalf. I know what you're thinking. Wow, Burr, you're such a nice guy eating eggs on our behalf. I know. Dome Keeper run ain't gonna live much fucking longer. Jesus, I suck. It sucks because I actually have a pretty good build for this run. I'm not gonna eat the egg. No, I'm gonna throw it on my bald, stupid head. Uh. 
But if you want to do one, $25. And if you want a truth or dare, that could cost you like... I probably should make it a dollar with how brutal these freaking dares are. But here, I owe Zulu Charlie my biggest regret in the world. Well... Ah, dude, I have a really bad, big regret, but it's like a sad regret. I don't know if you guys want to hear a sad regret. Because then you're going to give me pity. I don't want your damn pity. Maybe it'll be like $10 for a truth or dare. Yeah, I think 10 would be fine. Cue in the cyberpunk song. All right. I want to sleep alone prank on girlfriend. What? I want to sleep alone prank on boyfriend. What? What are these fucking... <laughs> How is that a prank? What? <laughs> I don't get it, man. All right. So, my biggest regret in the world... It's something I have to live with every day of my life. Every day. It's not an easy thing to live with every day, but I wake up and live with it. Virgil Sag. My biggest regret is not spending enough time with my dad when I was younger. For people that don't know, my dad passed away to lung cancer when I was 18. And of course, I was like most teenagers and didn't like spending time with my parents. And my biggest regret is not spending more time with him. Hey Dom, the domes are good. But I do remember he did take me to a Red Sox game once when I was like... 12. But that's my biggest regret. Now some people would say, would you trade anything to have a conversation with him? Fuck no! Fuck no, imagine how that conversation would go. Hey, Dad, I gave up my dream job to have this one conversation with you. He'd be like, oh, you're a fucking idiot. Why the hell would you do that? What? Did the Red Sox win that game? I don't remember, but I do remember Dustin Pedroia, my favorite player at the time, wasn't playing because he was injured, as always. I felt like a chump with my Dustin Pedroia jersey on. That's my biggest regret in life. Colon cancer when you were 18. Do you regret not spending more time with him? No idea who won either. Yeah, baseball's fun. Baseball's fun. But there, now you know my biggest regret. That really hits me right now because of a personal situation. I'm sorry to make that really hit you. I'm sorry. I still don't remember how to use this damn teleporter. Now, if you want to do a truth or dare, you can donate $10 to the NBCF and maybe you'll get something. I don't know. You'll get something. That's for sure. Why am I crying in the club right now? Damn, Shark's a bouncer. Do not trauma dump on us. Hey, hey, you asked. Well, someone that donated money to NBCF asked. I'm sorry. I don't make the rules. I just follow them. And now I have to break an egg on my head after Dome Keeper with my good shirt on. I might have to change my shirts. Ugh. The things I do for charity. Play real loud jams and the feels go away. But Brendan, when you try your best, but you don't succeed. When you get what you want, but not what you need. Just change skirts. You got it. I can't remember how to use the damn teleporter. 
If I may be real for a second, it's good to talk about these things. I think it reminds us how precious life is. You just never know what could happen. Okay, thank you. That's it. Back to Hyakin. Yeah, it is uh, a good reminder on the world that you get one life on this planet. And if you want to spend it, type in Sleepy Hyuk in my Twitch chat. That's on you. And where it like... Oh, that could be pretty smart, actually. Trash bag. I hate my trash bags, too, so... How the hell do I use this teleporter? So tell your family you love them. Tell your friends you love them. Donate $100 to your sh favorite streamers. What's up, Reld? Happy today. Hello. But thank you guys for donating money to National Breast Cancer Foundation. We're at $1,120 and I think 20 cents. That's pretty cool. That's money. Oh, one cent. Not 20. I need to go to a doctor and get my eyes thoroughly examined because I am apparently blind. <laughs> oh, there's no sense. I am most definitely blind. I should probably go see a doctor. But I want to sleep in your house. Ew, what? What the fuck? Oh, wait. I can't use the teleporter here. I can only use it over... Okay, wait. I'm sorry. So if I, I... I can just use it right here. Holy bullets. Oh my goodness. Look at all that. AMG. Look at all that cheddar. What's the donation incentive milestone to make Burr go to a doctor? I have reached out to doctors about getting an appointment and they all ghost me. They always say we'll get back to you within one business day and they never do. And I'm like, okay, I guess I'll die. Your grandma's recently came back and in a few days she's having both her breasts removed. I wish your grandma the best of luck on that surgery. Did I call back after? I did not call back. Because it was more so a thing you filled out online. They're like, oh, here's a convenient way to book an appointment. Apply for a new doctor. And it's just like, oh, God, man, can I just... Can I just, like, you know, go to the doctor? You trying to kill me, doctor? Ugh. Twitch chat books an appointment for their streamer. If I said my spleen was melting, they'd probably be like, you should probably go to a hospital. Don't call this number again, burr. They'll be like, how do you know my name? And I'll be like, because I'm inside your house. And I'll be like, oh, no. And they'll be like, yes. And I'll be like, no. And they'll be like, yes. And I'm like, okay. I can read the fine print again. Yo, your eyes don't work either? Nice, same. My eyes suck. Oh my, Mrs. Pirate. I wish you the best of luck. I'm inside your house. I live in an apartment complex. Oh. Oh. But I want to sleep in your house. It's like, oh, goodness gracious, what? What the 
fuck is that allowed? Can they say that? I wanna sleep in your house. I wanna sleep in your house. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, Bruno, don't sleep in my house. Don't sleep in my house. Don't sleep in my house. Yeah. <laughs> I want to sleep in your house. I want to sleep in your house. Dude, we got some fucking chickens. Oh my goodness, what is going on? God, how good this damn repellent is, to be honest. The repellent plus sword. God, how good they were. As a combination, you know what I mean? I have trouble reading menus when I go into a restaurant. If I go into, like, a fast food restaurant, I can't read the menu. I don't know if that's good or not, but... You have trouble reading chat? I do have trouble reading... I had to make the chat bigger. I learned how to do that. And I was like, oh, that's so convenient for me who can't read chat properly. Sounds like a skill issue. How about you suck a nut? How's that for a skill issue? You would. Damn! Yo, do it for charity? Do it for titties? His shepherd tone is kind of eating into your soul. Well, what are you going to do about it? Are you going to join the dark side of the force? The dark side of the force. I'm trying to get this upgraded so I can do some more damage. But I could also get this upgraded to do more damage with those. If I talk like this, he can't read what I say. Joke's on you, I can read that. If I didn't... Actually, if I didn't have my glasses on, I wouldn't be able to read that. <laughs> I just checked. I'd have a hard time. The like looks like Ike or like she kind of. Cat, are you in the chat? The cat in the chat. Hi, right, do you want to get an egg and a trash a trash bag and poke a hole in it? I need to crack an egg on my head because I decided to do truth or dares for money and charity donations. And of course, someone chose dare when it was crack an egg on your head. Why not just use a towel? Because it's really annoying to get egg yolk out of a towel. If we're not doing laundry same day. And then it's going to smell really bad. And these are my towels. And I don't want to do that to my towel. I'd rather waste a shitty trash bag that we don't like. Yo, where's that dome resurrection at, man? What the hell? I also need to get a new shirt. I'll have to change the shirt off stream because you guys are not allowed to see me shirtless unless someone dropped $100 for NBCF right now. And you could see me shirtless, but that is not happening. Listen, dude, those shirts, dude, those towels. I, I don't go out and buy towels often. $100? Yeah. I ain't packing anything special under here. I'll show for a hundred. If it means a hundred bucks to charity, sure. 
I haven't gone to the gym in a few days, mind you that. Just be me taking a shirt off and putting the shirt on. You genuinely can't remember. See? I've been working on the viewer tier list video, but I quickly realized I don't like anyone in my chat, so I had to scrap it. Was that going to be your tweet, game nerd? Want to eat four beans with your shirt off? I'll put another shirt on. I'll have another shirt to put on. I think I got other clothes. Egg thing with shirt off? I don't know, man. Sure, I guess. If it's a hundred bucks for charity, I'll have a trash bag on me. Just like when I came into this world. Throw me in a trash bag and call me Sally, I guess. Oh no, it's big fucking Jerry! Where's the egg? Oh, there's the egg. I didn't see it in her hand. You think someone would donate $100 so I do it without my shirt on? What? Yeah. No? Oh, I need to, I need to put these away. Yeah, I guess we don't need one. Just give me the egg. Stormy's being a little shit. Just put it down, I guess. Oh, this run might be over. This run is not over. Thank God. You just realized? What? It's gonna completely run off my head. You just realized I didn't have any hair? That's nice of you. But I haven't had hair for a while. <laughs> yeah. I'm bald. No! I have some hair. You don't think about my bald head 24-7? What are you, normal? Shit, I need to find a water. It could be a dome resurrection now, baby! A dome resurrection! Cat, you wanna know something? I'm bald. Kat just said she's leaving me. She said it's been a good run. Did full hair gaming ever come in and thank me for their sub? No. So stormy. I look good, bald. You should see me without a shirt on. No resurrection, baby. Thank God. This run's going to be going for a bit. Can I find a piece of ore so I can, like, upgrade my sword? Or hell, maybe I'll upgrade the damn repellent. Oh, I'm blocking the resources again. Oh, sorry. Sorry. I'll go right above it. Didn't even realize. Dude, it's not fair. I'm, I'm in a fat phase right now. I've... I've had takeout two nights in a row, and I haven't gone to the gym. Last time I went to the gym, I only ran, like... I don't even know how much I ran. Uh, my dome's back. My dome's back and we're gonna party. Not take out? I know, dude. You won't even be able to see my six pack that totally exists. 
Did you shit out the kid yet? That is a statement to say. Keep it in your fridge. I got a four pack of some uh, Captain Morgan in my fridge. A1. Yeah, I'll do it. What you said. If it's $100 to charity, sure. That gets us closer to the horror game incentive and the marathon game incentive. Wrong stream when? When Matthew gets the $1,500 raised, there's a Bread and Fred incentive. That's on Matthew's stream, though. You said it, A1. I said yes. This, this dome needs to end. But the dome resurrection came in. Dude, where is the ore at? My god. I got so much water, but there's no ore. I got six waters from that. And three cobalt. Deal's a deal. Sleepy higher. Thank you for the $100. A to the one. Let's get the four beans over with. First bean. Oh no. This is the bean that makes me puke. First bean is dead fish. Or strawberry banana smoothie. Strawberry banana smoothie is a delicious bean, but dead fish makes me puke. Makes me gag. Oh no, no. It's dead fish. <laughs> There's an egg here. <sighs> Mask the flavor. That's coward's play. Oh, thank God it's a blue bean. Toothpaste or berry blue? Oh, a nice little vacation. Mmm. Mmm. Nice and toothpastey. Right after the dead fish is perfect. Next is dirty dishwasher or birthday cake. Ugh. Dirty dishwasher lingers. That was part of Diego. Dead fish is the worst one by a mile for me. I don't know what that is. I think that's a dirty dishwasher. Yeah. Ugh. Okay, one more. One more. One more. One more. No! <laughs> what the fuck? Another dead fish? You gotta be kidding me! What? Is that a dead fish? Or is that a stink bug? Oh, God. Might be a stink bug. But I'd rather have it be a toasted marshmallow. Oh, that's a stink bug. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Four bad beans in a row. Oh. 
This game is awful. Eh, we're raising money for charity, so I don't mind. Yeah, the odds are becoming more in my favor. I'll start getting some good ones eventually, right? Watch freaking NBC if you're like, oh no, the boxes we send out, they're all bad beans. I don't think I've had a single good bean yet. Have I? Maybe a buttered popcorn or... Oh no, I had a cappuccino, but that sucks. No, I, I fucking hate Bean Boozle. I hate Bean Boozle. I'll, I'll, I'll give it credit where it's due. Like, it's a really good thing for, like, Twitch... For, like, Twitch stuff. But, God, do I despise that shit. No, there is no 50-50 split. It's just good luck. Is it weird you want to go get normal jelly beans? Uh, no, at least you'll have normal ones. I, I almost bought Bean Boozles for this charity event a, few, a couple days ago. Because I was like, oh man, Bean Boozles are always great to make people incentivized to donate. And then NBCF comes in with a truth or dare kit and a goddamn Bean Boozle packet. And I'm like, motherfuckers, these people. The audacity of these people. I got toothpaste. That's technically still a bad bean. That's still technically the bad one of the berry blue and toothpaste, but blue is just basically a freebie. Truth or dare kit? Yeah. Ten dollars. Hey, A1, you want to do another truth or dare? You donated a hundred dollars. It's only fair. Ten dollars gets you truth or dare. Sometimes I'll do both, like now. <clears throat> what is a childish thing you still do? Truth or dare? Ch th the truth is, what is a childish thing you still do? Pick my nose. Dare. Sing a song with a mouthful of water and make viewers guess the song. All right, you guys have to guess the song with a mouthful of water. All right, this should be fun. What do we win? Uh, Shark, you guys can get a new 7TV emote. I don't know. I have to sing it? Jesus, okay. I don't know how I'm supposed to sing and talk with a mouthful of water. <clears throat> to be completely honest with you, I don't know how that's possible. And that's literally just called spitting. Go back to the humming. Bitch, you're about to run out of water. And I need my water for beans. Maybe restart the whole damn song. Because you guys are going off technicalities when it's literally not even possible. Little streamer, you're not actually singing the song even though it's fucking impossible to actually sing the song. It, I can't sing! You can't sing with a mouthful of water! Good job, Pistol Pete. Thank you for ending that torture. That was the first song that came into my head. So when we using that pink hairspray on what fucking hair?
No, they said not to get it in your eyes or up your nose or anything like that, so I'm not putting it on my beard. Can you fucking do something? Jesus. What the hell is the point of this guy? Armpit hair? I haven't shaved my pits in a while. Guys, I have to go to the store later to get food to live. Are you guys LeBron James doing a dunk on the Boston Celtics? Because God, God damn, you got no regard for human life. I'm saying I can't go to the store with a pink beard. I'd rather not. Can we paint cat's hair? Sure. Cat, what's the price to get your hair pink? Order more takeout, fatty. Let's wait till after this dome run. You'll be calling me skinny legend. That's when I found out my wife was only carrying three bucks. And I said, I thought you were gonna hit the ATM today. She said, I never got around to it. So where's your wallet anyway? I said, never mind. Just help me find some change. And now the lady at the window was looking at me kind of strange. And she said, Mr. Please, we got to move this line along. I said, hold your stinking horses, lady. We won't be long. So I checked around in the glove box and checked the nap beneath my feet. I found a nickel and an ashtray and a couple pennies and a dime in the spring between the seat. Cat, cut your hair and glue it on him and paint that. We are not doing that. Maybe not. Maybe we are doing that. We do have gorilla glue. Are the stupidest thing I've ever said. And that's when I found out my wife was only carrying three bucks. And I said, bitch, what the fuck? What the fuck? What the? What? 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 How much for Cat to shave her hair? She is not shaving her hair. I can just put the Gorilla Glue on my skin, then sue them. That's what people do, right? They do stupid shit like that and then sue the company. And the company's like, you're fucking stupid. Why would you do that? Yeah, Duke, and then she tried to, like, sue them, didn't she? And I'm pretty sure she lost in court, because... Paint the cats pink? Nami just had surgery, and she went through a struggle taking medicine this morning. I think the last thing she wants to do is become pink.
And Stormy isn't even giving her a warm welcome home. Stormy's just like, who the fuck is this new bitch? They have to learn life sucks. Cats don't have the brain to realize life sucks. They just have the brain to live. He did a GoFundMe to raise money for the surgery to remove it. God, I hope. I, I That's a GoFundMe I hope failed. Help, you guys. I put Gorilla Glue in my hair because I'm stupid. Give me money to get rid of it. I need a million dollars. I live in America. made me tweet the he him hole that was arlen Oh man, this dome keeper run's not looking too hot right now. I can get some anything, really. I haven't found anything in a while, I feel like. What are you getting blamed for? Blamed for? It was literally you, the goddamn the he him whole tweet. Blamed for my ass. What? You replied on that tweet. I'm sure other people did too. And they're like, what the fuck? I got to start making a bunch of tweets. So that one gets lost away in the timeline forever. Streamer, it's my birthday today. Well, the good news is we raised twelve hundred dollars so far. Twelve oh one. So that's nice. Kind of messed up, Dillab. Well, you know, sometimes some people suck. Luckily, none of you suck as you guys are the cutest chat in the world. <gasps> Ooh, woo. Dude, what the fuck? Ah! Oh no, it's big fucking Jerry. Big Jerry is big dead. And it's the gay person's fault.
I be in gaslit? You gaslighting me? Is this what it feels like to be a victim? I'm a white heterosexual male, so I'm never a victim. But is this what it feels like to be a victim? What's up, Koyax? Or is always a victim? How? I'm never a victim. What are you talking about? All I do is sit here and bathe in my riches. You have to deal with chat? Oh, that's nothing. You guys are fucking nothing. You guys who only victimize you? Oh, please. I don't... I don't complain about you guys to my therapist, Debbie. All I do is sit here and victimize myself. What the fuck are you talking about? Hey, someone bought Tantrum merch. Thanks. This is free? Sure. I like free. Hey, Petri. Two ticks crawling on me after taking your dog for a walk and four off of her. Oh, Lodima, goodness gracious. Hi, thanks for the beanie. Oh, you bought a beanie with the gift card? Nice. Thanks for buying a beanie. Also, for people that don't know, the pin update. We need, we have 15 orders for pins. We need 15 more for those pins to get made. So get your hyuk pins. Don't worry, the hyuk pins aren't going anywhere though, so that's good. You can't get the pins and the plush. Someone buy the pins, then ship them to A1. I hate ticks. I am a normal human. I do not like ticks. Fucking big Jerry over here. Oh, we're still alive somehow. I don't know why the pins are so damn expensive to ship to Europe. I don't understand. They said they were going to respond to Game Nerd, and then they never did. Replace Tick with Frat Boys. Oh my. Oh my. You know, I can't name many things worse than a tick. But, I can name one thing worse than a tick. A Republican! <laughs> They're the same thing! <laughs> Got them. All, my, all the Republicans just left the chat. They will not see me with my shirt off, but they probably didn't want to. Corporate needs you to find the difference between these two pictures. You're the same picture. Cancer? Cancer is worse than ticks. So donate your money to NBCF.
Every $25 raises a bean boozle, and if you donate $10, you can have a truth or dare card. Which maybe you don't even want, but you can get it. Now, Dome is not in the best of shape right now, I can agree. But don't worry, the 20 the, the bean boozles are a collective effort. The truth or dares, that's a you exclusive. Switching parties felt like I was leaving a cult. <laughs> Imagine being a Scientologist. I need to get my uh, drill damage up, it seems. Hopefully this is enough to get it up. I don't think it is, though. I think I need 12. Used to be a conservative Christian. I used to be nothing. And I was a douchebag. Yo, what's up? I'm a conservative Christian, and I'm a douche. Repping Jesus for life, baby. JC on the down low. Uh, guys, I have uh, bad news about the dome. We are in uh, deep, deep trouble. <laughs> Fucking Big Jerry's back. Two Big Jerry's. Three Big Jerry's. Oh, we gotta start stuck. We gotta start sucking their life away. Oh, I can't even see the damn deer that's hiding behind the Big Jerry. Attack did nothing, Dome Keeper. Oh my god, big fucking Jerry. Ay, ay, ay. Don't wake up and be a big Jerry. Well, guys, I think this dome keeper runs about to be over. It's not looking too promising right now. I could upgrade my health, I think, one more time. That might be able to get me an extra run, but I'm not finding any Cobalt. But this has been, I think, the best run since we've been playing Dome again. You start to play Marbles? No. Enjoy the work. Thanks for the lurk. I still got a crack and egg on my head. If I could get another Dome Resurrection, that would be kind of huge. But I am six cobalt away from that. Uh, someone did the truth or dare thing. The with the ten dollar donation, and the dare was crack an egg on my head. And then A1 donated a hundred dollars to crack an egg on my head without a shirt on. 
And me being the sellout little slut that I am, I did it. Two more big Jerry's. Ay, ay, ay. I'm not that ripped. Okay, that doesn't seem to work. We could make a lot more than $110 for that. Do you think people really want to see me without a shirt on that badly, though? I'm gonna have a trash bag over my head. The sword dome is actually like the best one, I think. Thanks for the hundred bits though, Arlen. I'm probably going to stand while I crack the egg on my head as well. Egg is densely packed with nutrition and proteins that help condition, strengthen, and repair your hair. Thank you for the hundred bits. So you're telling me if I crack an egg on my head every single day, I could have a luscious head of hair by the end of the year? Why not put a bag on the floor, then lean forward? Eh. I'm not sure. I didn't think of that. I was just thinking the bag would catch it. The nutrients that are naturally present in eggs make your hair glossy and help in faster hair growth, too. Thank you for the hundred more bits. Faster hair growth? Well, I don't got none. I'll use one of them to heal. Dude, I'm one away from getting a drill upgrade. Maybe I can find four more cobalt to get another resurrection. My cobalt automatically got used and saves me. I break an egg on my head and I come on stream with the most luscious head of hair. <laughs> the fucking dream right there if I've ever had one. I like it. I like that if it auto spends cobalt to repair your dome. I was just going to say, maybe I could even try to escape, but I don't think I'm going to have enough time to try to escape. And I don't think I'm going to be able to... Honestly, maybe I get the bomb. I'm not going to have enough time to even try to get the hell out of here.
If I got out of here, I could double my score. It's the end of the dome as we know it. Well, gamers, this might be the end of this dome run. For real this time, unless I pull off a miracle. I don't have any cobalt. Big fucking Jerry ahead of us. Micah! Uh, five Fi is summoning me? Wow. What do I gotta do? What's happening? What's going on? Micah and Fi Fi want to play party animals? Listen, I'm in the middle of the dome run of my life right now. Hi, Bur. Why are you looking extra hot today? Want to play in a few hours. Uh, maybe? I I'm a big maybe. Thank you for the 41 months. I love you, my king. Uh, maybe. I might be down. We will see. I need to go to the store. And I also am going to need to take a shower because I have to break an egg on my head. Break an egg on my head. Because he's about to take his shirt off. Don't tell Fi Fi that. Then his subathon's going to end. He's going to be like, yo guys, I'm ending stream. Just like when GC ended stream to watch me play Dang It Grandpa. He's drooling over you. I haven't showered this morning either. I haven't even showered. Bye bye, thank you for the 41 months. Crowns, thank you for the 24 months. If Five Five's still watching, hey, we're close to a hype train over here. Sleepy Kevin. Thank you, Crowned. Thank you, Fire D. Ragon. Sleepy Kevin. Also, we're raising money for NBCF. Donate your money to titties. This run is about to end. I hope you guys enjoyed this run, because I sure did. There's nothing I can do, man. There's nothing I can do to make this run live. Hype train started. Thanks for the 100 bits, Doog. I guess I can increase the pad size. But... Yeah, there's nothing I can really do here. This run is dead, so that means it's time for the egg. Oh my 
my lord. Yeah, this run is dead. <laughs> One bullet is all it took. One bullet is all it took. I survived 30 waves though, Jesus. <laughs> I got to rank 417 with a third. Wait, dude, I didn't even PB from that? What? I should have ran. He says your friendship can be bought and money will make you play with us. Thank you for the 200 bits. I mean, it's in three hours. You said a few hours. I'm not going to be streaming in a few hours. Thanks for the bits. I now have to break it. So someone donate $100 for me to break an egg with my shirt off on my head. Because we're doing truth or dare as well. Because NBCF sent me these lovely cards and jelly beans. So now it's time for the egg on the head. But thanks for watching YouTube Let's Play.